Okay, my dearest friends. Oh, I just want you to, to know and see something really just symbolic for me. It's just symbolic. So uh, the, if you can see the, the, the butterfly on the milkweed plants uh, flying around, I take it as a signal of the support and the liberty of the Baha'is of Iran. Uh, I don't know how many of you know, yesterday, uh, a couple of days ago actually, the Senate of the United States um, signed, approved of a resolution um, in defense of the Baha'is of Iran, Senator Rubio, Senator Guzman. It is so powerful, so lifted my heart. It was like a present for um, Rez Rezvan. And there it is also, this butterfly, my goodness, is a present for Rezvan. And she's sitting, she comes and visits the milkweed uh, flowers, which is, I planted it specially for the butterflies. <clears throat> and uh, there she comes. Oh, there she comes. Oh my goodness. There she comes. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. I just absolutely love it. I just love it. I, I planted these milkweeds from seeds. And there they are. And I hope you can enjoy just watching it. Um, I just hope that the Baha'is of Iran are able to open their wings and serve the way the message, the statement of the House of Justice for Rizwan talks about building capacity and sustainability and learning skills to teach the faith and being able to shine your light. Nothing more important for someone to be able to show the capacities of their soul and their heart and fulfill their purpose of life. Nothing more important than that. And so I'm hoping that the friends um, all over the world take advantage of these resolutions and use them, loud them, share them in their social media, in their in their conversation with their friends and um, spread it because, yeah, a resolution is great, is wonderful. And, um, uh, but tweeting this, that uh, going to the site of the senator and tweeting, retweeting it with a comment or something, it's our job. And they would love it. They love it if we share a story. I shared the story of one of my students um, who told me, they're all suffering from PTSD, told me that how she has nightmares of the day when the in the first grade, the teacher took, pulled her hand, took her to the yard because she was a Baha'i and telling her that she's gonna throw her in a well filled with, with rats. So um, they will eat her up. And she ever since has had uh, nightmares, cannot focus, has anxiety all of that so i had to do a little treatment for ptsd and thank god it was very effective and helped but we need to speak up we we need to think of them pray about them and think about what can we do that's a statement of the house of justice it is not easy to um to be a baha'i this day you need, we need to reflect upon how do we bring the teachings of the faith into action. And one of them is about justice. The best beloved of all things in my sight is justice, Baha'u'llah talks about. And the message of the statement of the House of Justice um, has so much, so many reminders that we cannot just be, just be wishing for things, wishing for a world of unity and oneness. We need to be part of bringing it about and um, speaking out, thinking, reflecting. So, yeah, this is for me um, a very special sign uh, today. When I was just looking out from the window and I saw this butterfly hopping from one of these milkweed plants to another, it just absolutely reminded me of my friends in Iran. So, happy Rezvan to all of you, my dearest. I hope every breath you take becomes a cause of joy, freedom, liberty, fulfillment, hope, 
to others in the world, especially our beleaguered friends in Iran. Love you. Bye-bye.